Yeah, it's good being back. Um, obviously, coming back into the Cat Fiddle is uh, it's strange not being here for was it nine years, eight nine years, uh, seeing the changes around the place. And yeah, it's good. It's good to be back. I mean, it must have uh, improved a fair bit since you left eight yeah, or nine definitely, years ago. Yeah, definitely. Definitely with the uh, the 4G down there, is it? And the, the the first team pitch looks fantastic now. It's it's a lot a lot changed since last time. I was just mud, I think, when yeah. I was here. So yeah, it's. it's with this as well, the uh, stand-up thing just inside the door is fantastic. Um, can you just run us through how the, the move came about? Yeah, well, uh, it was a weird one. I was on holiday. I got a text saying uh, Paul was looking for a left-back and I should put my name forward. So uh, my agent phoned up and had a, had a few uh, interested clubs apart from Exeter. And uh, when Exeter came, it was, it was always going to be something I, I wanted to do. And... And then luckily we, we got over the line. Cause, I mean, Exeter's a, a club very close to your heart having yeah, started here. Yeah. So, I mean, that's the, probably a massive pull in terms of coming back here. Yeah, definitely. I, I've always I've always thought about coming back here. And, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm just glad it's it's now. And I'm not coming back at 36, 37 just, just to see out my days. I'm here to, to win. I want to get promoted. I don't want to be in League 2, to be honest. But, um, yeah, I want to get promoted with Exeter and keep, keep doing what we did when I, I left here. And you've probably kept an eye on Exeter's results and how they've been doing yep. since you've been away. So you'll know, you know, this squad uh, reasonably well, and you, yeah. it's a squad that can get promoted. Yeah, it's a, to. it's a fantastic squad. Um, I was in on holiday, and I, I actually watched the playoff final in in the sports bar over there. I was I was gutted for them. It's it's not a nice place to go and, and lose, putting all that effort into the playoffs. And I came to the semi final second leg, and, and what a what a team performance and what a all round great atmosphere. As I, I couldn't believe how good the atmosphere was and I just got it for them really uh, I think this team deserves to be in League One at least and uh, I think if they had, if we had had a better start last season without the injuries and stuff and I think we would have easily gone up um, And how much are you looking forward to getting back in next City shirt out there training and yeah. back at St James's Park? Yeah, I've, uh, it's, it's nice to have the kit back on I've got my, my number back and uh, yeah, it's, it's good I'm looking forward to it and obviously I know the coaches here and Matty and Wayne have, have, have stepped into that as well it's, I'm, I'm very excited my family are excited to, to be moving back as well I've, I left with no children and no wife and now I've got three children so and a wife mm. <laughs> so yeah, it's uh, we're all excited and they're from uh, my wife's from down this way as well so it's, it's nice to be around family again and the, the supporters will be delighted at, obviously at your signing you've got a real good relationship with the Exeter City fans as well haven't you yeah they've always been fantastic with me obviously coming through as a, a 16, 17 year old getting in the team and uh, yeah they've been they've been fantastic and hopefully I can repay them with some good performances this year and hopefully get promoted